And uh, the first speaker this evening is uh, Mrs. Sarah Ferguson. I think the Battle of Flowers judges were quite wrong. I thought yours was the best. You know. <laughs> I've been working with Age Concern, the St. Relance Bay Development Group, and the Lamaria Community Garden Project, plus others, which you'll find in my leaflet. So I've had first hand confirmation about the concerns which worry you, the public like the stealth taxes masquerading as charges for health, hospital, liquid waste, solid waste, long-term care, and the proposed community infrastructure charge. Before 010, those people paying tax at 20% paid more than 50% of the income tax revenues collected. Today, those paying tax in the marginal rate pay over 50% of the income tax collected. In other words, Middle of Jersey is carrying the bulk of tax collected, and these so-called charges are going to hit the lower income and the Middle of Jersey hardest. The medium-term plan, which is giving authority for the charges, is being debated shortly after the election. There is time to bring an amendment to the plan so that no charges should be implemented until there is a proper review of tax, including 010. 010, we were told, was the answer to the treatment we were getting from the EU and the OECD. It has turned out to be an incredible on-island tax avoidance scheme. High earners pay, pay, place part of their earnings into a company and don't pay tax unless they withdraw them. Or a trading company can retain its profits. When a shareholder retires, they sell their shares to their successor and bingo. Profits become capital and are not taxed. There are those who would say, bring in capital taxes. I say, keep the system simple. Return to a simple, straightforward tax system, which is fair. At the moment, it is not fair. Middle Jersey is hurting badly. Obviously, another problem is population. My scrutiny panel pointed out two years ago, there are no controls. We don't even know the tax status of all the 1,500 net immigrants last year. We need to set up controls, probably along the Australian or New Zealand lines. The time remaining in this session is short, but it's still possible to make a difference through scrutiny, questions, propositions, and so forth. But please remember, your vote is your voice. Please use it, preferably for Sarah Ferguson, but please use it.